Hi guys, I'm Georgia, I'm your independent sensory consultant. Thank you for joining me, I just thought I'd jump on and do a quick video to let you know about what I received today. I have received eventually my testers for autumn winter 2020. Yay, I'm so excited. So this little bag here is full of, you can hear them, lots of little testers. I'm so excited, I've been so excited to get these. Um, so I've sat on my bed this afternoon, I had a little sniff and um, I can honestly say I'm not disappointed. I literally want to try everything. Um, so what I've done is I've picked out eight of our fragrances out of the new testers and um, they are the ones that I think are good for now. It's a bit of a funny time of year because a lot of these new ones ha um, are quite Christmassy, um, quite wintry, there's a lot of cinnamon and pastry and that sort of thing going on. Um, but the ones that I've picked out today, out of the new ones, um, I think they're good enough for now. I think it's something that you could buy now and um, just break gently into the winter. So what I'll do is I'll take you through the ones that I've picked, I'll let you know what I think of them and I'll also let you know what Sensi has to say about them. Okay, let's start. Well, first of all, we're going to start with Autumn Road Trip. So Autumn Road Trip, I have been so excited for this. Before hearing anything or any of the rumours and whispers that go around, um, I went through the scent notes and this is actually one of the ones that I decided that I wanted to get. So, oh my gosh, yes, it's absolutely amazing. So yeah, this one is, it, it's perfect for now. So. Autumn Road Trip, definitely apples in there, I can absolutely without a doubt get the apples. Say apples and pears, yeah this is really nice, I'm really into the apples this um, this time round. I tried Johnny Appleseed and absolutely loved it, I can't wait to, to warm this. Oh, it's so good, okay so yeah I definitely picked up on the apple in it, let's see what Sensi have to say about Autumn Road Trip. Okay, Autumn Road Trip. Take a tour through Crisp Harvest Apple. Just picked Anjou Pear and a forest of towering silver oak. Yeah, I definitely get the forest. There is sort of an air of the forest there, but definitely apples. Absolutely love it. There's the first one for your list. Okay, so the next one that I've picked out going to get my notes up for this one. The next one that I've picked out is Blueberry Rush. Mm. Yeah, definitely getting the blueberries. It's absolutely lovely. Um, again, it's not a winter smell. It's perfect for now. So we're in between summer, winter, autumn, whatever we want to call it. Um, it's tricky because if you like to sort of keep the house with the season, if you like to have those seasonal scents, um, this time of year is a little bit tricky, I always think. But anyway, I picked Blueberry Rush. Sensi say, a sweet surge of ripe blueberry leads a luscious bouquet of lively cranberry, blackcurrant and pomegranate. Yeah, it's, oh, oh yeah, I'm getting the blackcurrant. Yeah, I can smell the blackcurrant in there, but there is um, blueberry, cranberry, blackcurrant and pomegranate. And I highly recommend that one. Love it. Next on my list that I've picked out is Cozy Cardigan. This is actually sold out at the moment and out of stock, but it will be coming back. Um, oh, it's just so relaxing. Very relaxing. I would say it's definitely a bedroom smell. Um, it's not massively overpowering. It is a very cosy smell. So, like it says in the in the title, does what it says on the tin. Sensi say, find bedded bliss in layers of soft suede, blushing rose, and amber silk. Definitely getting. I'm definitely getting the suede actually. Yeah, there's definitely a leathery smell about it. 
with that little bit of rose coming through and the amber is gorgeous very nice next on my list the next one that i've picked out should i say is ice citrus so i'll pick this one out apart from it being absolutely beautiful you might be a bit put off if you hear the citrus if you're not really a citrus sort of person because yes i can definitely get the citrus in it but it's very subtle and it's just got a really really nice um fragrance about it scentsy say frozen lemon and iced pineapple yeah it's the pineapple Frozen lemon and iced pineapple are garnished with just enough crushed mint to start, cause a stir. So yeah, it's not, if you don't like citrus, um, maybe give this a try because it's not cit overpowering citrus. You definitely get the lemon and the pineapple, but it's just very, just a hint um, and just a beautiful smell. Love that one. Okay, the next one. I'm really glad I like this one because I saw it on the list, saw it in the scent notes and I was like, oh, please, please, please let me like this one. So I've got it today. It's called Pepperberry Sage. I'm just going to get the scent notes up for it. Okay. Oh. Okay. So again, it's not quite Christmas, but there is a hint of Christmas in there. But I think this would be really nice now when the nights are starting to come in dark. Sorry, my dog's barking in the background. Um, when the nights are coming coming in dark and you try to get cosy, this is lovely. There's definitely a foresty thing going on. But you can most definitely smell the sage. Let's see what Sensi have to say about it. Okay, rich herbaceous pepperberry and sage complement bayberry in a complex natural naturally inspired fragrance yeah it's very um herby but i love it absolutely love it again another one that i recommend out of these ones okay we've got three more left the next one that i chose and i think a lot of you are going to like this one is red pear and pomegranate oh look at the color awesome um yeah so it's definitely fruity if you're into fruity smells you're gonna really like this one i'm just gonna get the scent notes for it okay excuse me yes i thought i could smell rhubarb in there so sensi says sweet tart notes of pomegranate and rhubarb are polished by crisp energizing red pear that's why I like it so much. That pear. Oh, it's really good. So yeah, I would recommend that one. That one, um, I would use in the sitting room, without a doubt. Gorgeous. All right, two more to go. So next up, we have got Twilight Frost. Another lovely colour. Oh, so good. Now I really like this one and I know why. It's got lavender in. I'm just getting a hint of lavender. It's not overpowering lavender. It's not like old grandma lavender smell. There's just a hint of it in there. Let's see what Scentsy say because I'm interested. It's really nice. Okay. Bold floral notes of orange blossom and wild lavender are deepened by a bed of twilight moss really good yeah it's very nice um again light that's why i've picked these they're quite light and not heavy there's no cinnamon in there there's no um pastry or anything like that going on which is great through christmas i love that through the winter seasons and in, in autumn and um the pumpkin smells but these aren't quite like that this is kind of like a transition to kind of bring us based on my own preferences okay the last one that i have got is winterberry apple tea i've been so excited about this one and i wasn't disappointed oh gosh 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 
Okay, I'll get the scent notes up for it because it is quite hard to describe some of them. But again, it's the apple thing. I love apple. So winter tea cozies up to cranberry, apple and honey. Definitely getting the sweetness of it and I think that's what I like about it. Um, yeah, it's a very sweet apple, but not too sweet. I don't like too sweet. But definitely something you could cozy up to on a night now as the nights are starting to draw in. So that was my eight that I chose. There's lots more to choose from. Thank you so much for watching. Please check out my website. I will put the link below. If you want any further help or you would like to place an order, please contact me. You can direct message me or you can contact me on my email, which is gbrown99 at aol.com. I'd love to hear from you. And thanks for joining me today. Really appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.